A relational database management system is a database management system that is based on the relational model as introduced by EF Code, of IBM San Jose Research Laboratory. Many popular databases currently in use are based on the relational database model. Our DBMSs have become a predominant choice for the storage of information in new databases used for financial records, manufacturing and logistical information, personnel data, and much more since the 1980s. Relational databases have often replaced legacy hierarchical databases and network databases because they are easier to understand and use. However, relational databases have been challenged by object databases, which were introduced in an attempt to address the object relational impedance mismatch in relational database and XML databases. Market share, according to research company Gartner, the five leading commercial relational database vendors by revenue in 2011 were Oracle, IBM, Microsoft, SAP including Sybase, and Teradata. The three leading open source implementations are MySQL, PostgreSQL, and SQLite. MariaDB is a prominent fork of MySQL prompted by Oracle's acquisition of MySQLAB. According to Gartner, in 2008, the percentage of database sites using any given technology were, Oracle Database, 70%, Microsoft SQL Server, 68%, MySQL, 50%, IBM DB2-39%, IBM Informix, 18%, SAP Sybase Adaptive Server Enterprise, 15%, SAP Sybase IQ, 14%, Teradata, 11%, according to DB Engines. The most popular systems are Oracle, MySQL, Microsoft SQL Server, PostgreSQL and IBM DB2. History In 1974, IBM began developing System R, a research project to develop a prototype R DBMS. Its first commercial product was SQLDS, released in 1981. However, the first commercially available R DBMS was Oracle released in 1979 by Relational Software, now Oracle Corporation. Other examples of an RDBMS include DB2, SAP Sybase ASE, and Informix. Historical usage of the term, the term relational database was invented by EF Code at IBM in 1970. Code introduced the term in his seminal paper A Relational Model of Data for Large Shared Data Banks. In this paper and later papers, he defined what he meant by relational. One well-known definition of what constitutes a relational database system is composed of code's 12 rules. However, many of the early implementations of the relational model did not conform to all of code's rules, so the term gradually came to describe a broader class of database systems, which at a minimum, present the data to the user as relations. Provide relational operators to manipulate the data in tabular form. The first systems that were relatively faithful implementations of the relational model were from the University of Michigan. MicroDBMS, the Massachusetts Institute of Technology. And from IBM UK Scientific Center at Peter Lee. IS-1 and its follow-on Peer TV. The first system sold as an RDBMS was Multix Relational Data Store, first sold in 1978. Others have been Berkeley Angra QUEL and IBM BS12. The most popular definition of an RDBMS is a product that presents a view of data as a collection of rows and columns, even if it is not based strictly upon relational theory. By this definition, RDBMS products typically implement some but not all of code's 12 rules. A second school of thought argues that if a database does not implement all of code's rules, it is not relational. This view, shared by many theorists and other strict adherents to code's principles, would disqualify most DBMSs as not relational. For clarification, they often refer to some RDBMSs as truly relational database management systems, naming others pseudo-relational database management systems. As of 2009, most commercial relational DBMSes employ SQL as their query language. Alternative query languages have been proposed and implemented, notably the pre-1996 implementation of Berkeley Angra QUEL. References